Hi, everybody. I'm Vin Scully, and welcome to Game Six. If we win that World Series, that was this team would have gone down in absolute history as being one of the greatest teams ever. When we get to Game Six, we're up late. Mazzilli has a bead on it and puts it away. But the Red Sox come up with two big runs on a single double home run. And at the end of nine and a half, Red Sox five, Mets three. One inning. Win the little battles till it's over. Little poke job to left. Rice coming over. One away. The, the carrot was in front of you. It was right there. It's everything you've ever played for. Henderson going to run it down. And the Mets are down to their last out. It seemed like oh, it's there, it's there. Lined into left field, base hit for Carter, and the Mets are still alive. I think you can feel yourself winning. It's almost like a distraction. The tying runs are aboard, and that's going to be hit into center field, base hit. Two outs, two strikes with four or five hitters, and balls dropping in going, how? Oh, wow. Here comes Carter to score, and the tying run is at third. We got caught hanging on. Taking a long time to forgive yourself for the wrongs that were done during World Series. Getman reaches for it. You see, he hardly moved as far as shifting, and it gets by him a wild pitch. If you ask me what happened, I'm not sure. I just know that they scored, and they probably shouldn't have. Little roller up along first, behind the bag. It gets through Buckner. Here comes Knight, and the Mets win it. I mean, I'm a New England kid. I knew what was going on there. We should have been those guys. I mean, not until 2004, they become those guys.